Hey guys, and welcome to my third Let's Play of 8-Bit Summer 2024. This is Bad Dudes for the NES. I've played this game a little bit, and I know mo mostly what I know about the game is from the YouTube series Awesome Video Games. I really don't know too much more about it, but I mean, I know some. Yeah, you know, here's the story. This is what the president has been kidnapped by ninjas. Are you a bad enough dude to rescue the president? Alright, so. Let me see something here real quick. Ah. Hold on. Alright, there we go. Anyway, it's a beat em up style kind of game. And, uh, you, you're trying to rescue the president. By nin with ninja, so. It's really not that bad. Just be careful of... This game is actually surprisingly hard. So... But yeah, it's your basic beat em up style game. You can jump up to get your enemy. This is a relatively short game, too. I shouldn't finish this more than like two or three episodes. We're already at the boss of the first level. There we go. <sighs> yeah. I'm bad. Alright, so now the next level is the, is the, is the truck. The best thing to do is to jump over, uh, you need to jump over those or you're not going to make it too far. This game is surprisingly very hard. I wanted to, oh okay, I can get that weapon. Jeez, I've already got a game over. Yeah, this game is surprisingly hard, and I'm not sure exactly how many enemies you got to defeat to get past this part, but... Oh, nunchucks! I want the nunchucks! Jeez Louise.
Anyway. You gotta, you gotta get to the end. You gotta wait for the truck to load right there. So basically, you just gotta. This is more of a survival level. So. There we go. I may not survive the box though. Yeah, I didn't think I was gonna survive the boss. Yeah, this game is surprisingly hard. That's in the most. That's in the most inopportune place for. Uh... For nunchucks. Really? You got the nunchucks. Now let's see if I can actually survive with the nun- Ooh. Hold on just a second. Why is my... Oh, okay. I don't know why. It's back, it seems like it's backwards, but it's not. I need to try to step on the top because if you step, if you fall down to the bottom, you're gonna lose a lot of health. I don't lost so much health last time is uh, because I've kept falling off the uh, the truck. Try to stay on this side now. Definitely try to stay on this side now. Try to stay toward the middle at this part. Jeez. Come on. Trying to keep the uh, weapon. For the boss. It makes it a lot easier if you have the boss if you have a weapon for the boss. Come on. 
Alright. Let's kind of stay right here. There we go. And we got to beat level two. Alright, we're going to try to do level three real quick and then we're off to uh, see what we can do about level three. We're just the sewer. I think there's eight levels. But yeah, the sewers are actually kind of straightforward. It's just quit pogo sticking. Ah, oh well. All right, we can let's see how let's see if we can get past level three. There's got to be an obligatory sewer level. Just don't hit the water, because the water will hurt you. I don't need the knife again. I've already got a knife. All right, come on. I'll take that though. Help. Ah. Should be getting close to the boss. Yeah, boss time. Just kind of sit right here. Do all this thing in. Like I said, the secret is to just stay right here in the middle. Then do it one more time. And got him. And here we go. Woo! We got through level three, and then level four is going to be in the forest. But we're going to end it here when we come back.
We're going to go through the forest. This, is, this almost kind of, looks, kind of looks like a Contra level, but we'll do this next time on Let's Play Bad Dudes, part of 8-Bit Summer. This is DKS3 and the Crazy Gamer. Sign it out.